So to publish your app, first of all, you have to create an account with shinyapps.io. I'm going to drop a link in the lecture resources. So you go to shinyapps.io and you are going to sign up. If you don't have an account, you sign up. If you have an account, you log in. So after logging in, you are going to have a dashboard like this. So you go to accounts. You are going to have a dashboard like this. You go to accounts and you go to tokens. So when you go to tokens, then you click on show. And you copy this token to your clipboard. So it's going to add as a secret key here. So it is going to show you the secret key. Then you copy it to your clipboard. Control C. Okay, so you leave it copied on your clipboard. So next, we go back to our web app on R Studio. So this is our movie explorer. We are going to publish our movie explorer on the web. You run the app. And you click on publish. So I'm going to click on publish. So you can see already, I already have my accounts connected, but for you, if you don't have your account connected, so you are going to have an interface like this. If I click on new account, so you are going to have something like this, connect account to any of this. So I'm going to be using shinyapps.io, which already have already created the account. So when you click on shinyapps.io, you paste it here. So I'm going to paste it here. You paste what you copied from the dashboard you from your dashboard on the web and you connect your accounts. So because I already have my accounts connected, so because I already have my accounts connected, so I'm going to you, at the end I also have something like this, then you click on publish. So after pasting that secret token and you click on create, then you're supposed to have an interface like this and you click on publish. So we are going to wait for the app to deploy. So now already we have our app deployed. So you can see the URL to the app. So if you copy this URL and paste it or you share it with someone, then your, anybody you share it with is going to be able to view your app. So that is how you deploy your app using Arashaini.